guys. I was about to go get some laundry out of the laundry room, opened the door, and thought that there was a cat right out there in the light, and was about to step out, and it wasn't a cat. Guess what it was? It was a raccoon. So I went to get the camera, come back, and he's been joined by a friend. So not only was it not a cat, it was a raccoon, but from the time of getting the camera, it has become two raccoons. So I can't even go over to that door over there, which is where my laundry room is, and get the laundry in my dryer because it's like, I don't know, just before 10 o'clock. And I have got <laughs> two raccoons out here pigging out. Oh, and I also had to go activate the spotlight on my security cam so that you can see them in the light. Because other than that, it's pitch black out here and you wouldn't be able to see them. But yeah. Miss Dawn almost stepped outside to some bandits being out here while she stepped outside to get laundry. Oh, it's a good thing that when the door open, it act it activates the the security light for me and that's when I paused and was like, "Hmm, why is that cat stopped at the end of my driveway where you know where the tire is on my car? See where they're going now? That's where they were that's where the one was. And I was like, why is that cat why are they hunched up like that? Like they are, you know, scared. And then they turned around and walked towards me. And that's when I realized <laughs> You're not a cat. You're a little masked bandit. Here at only 10 o'clock at night. You're not even here in the middle of the night, which is when they normally come. <laughs> You're here raiding the cat food bowls. I guess I'm going to have to be a little more careful when I go to the laundry room. And I've had to separate the water dishes from where the food dishes are. The water dishes used to be in between the food dishes there. But these little bandits like to wash their paws in the water dishes and especially if the water dish is right next to the food dish so to get them from to stop them from washing their paws in the water dishes I had to move the water dishes a little bit out of their immediate um vicinity and you know that kind of helps keep them clean a little longer but if they find them they will go to the water dish and still wash their paws and baby precious is down here you can't see him because the house is dark because this was going to be my last task before going to bed so the house all the lights are off and Baby Precious is down here watching these raccoons. Of course, he thinks they're just funny-looking cats. Huh, Baby Precious? The other raccoon is already gone. This raccoon hears me talking, and he's like, Who is this lady? 
or who what is this noise I hear of this person talking I mean because when I opened the door and like stepped one foot out the raccoon didn't take off I mean it came up back up to to eat I just closed the door and came back in the house And uh, I wonder if this is the same duo. Oh, he's coming to the door. I wonder if this is the same duo that visits my back patio. Because I've got them on camera visiting the back patio too. Or maybe that's a different duo. I don't know. But... I've got at least a couple possum and a couple raccoon that clean out the food dish on the back patio every night too. But my cameras out front here have been catching the raccoons coming up my driveway or walking up across the front entryway on a regular basis now because now they have figured out that there is food out here every night. I know, baby pushers, but I'm telling you right now, guess what? This raccoon is definitely not interested in being your friend. I got my laundry basket right here ready to go. Because, like I said, I stepped out the door. And was not prepared to have masked bandits already on my carport. Man, they have I just put food out this morning and I filled all three bowls. They have cleaned all three bowls out. I mean, they're empty. They have cleaned them completely out. They went from the one on the end up, oh, and my security camera just stopped recording. Let me see if I can turn. And there goes the raccoon. He just took off. Yep, they're gone. When I turn the flash on to the camera, up, oh, there's a tiny bit of food left. Oh man, look at all the food they spilled into the moat. But most of the food is gone. But at least the water dishes are still clean. <sighs> And um, we had thunderstorms, so it's really wet out here. Okay. Well, maybe now I can get this last load out of the laundry room and go to bed, guys. That was my <laughs> exciting evening. A couple little masked bandits on my carport. Love, hugs, and kitty kisses. See you guys later.